What's going on? I'm Justin Simeon, and you are watching Fade to Black on 24 Wired TV. I've always just kind of felt drawn to telling stories. Like as you know, young as I can remember, I was like drawing comic books. I was like, you know, playing with my action figures, video, you know, doing like stop motion video stuff with my little action figures. It's always been a version of that that I, I was doing for fun. And, and like I said, you know, when I realized that I could actually make movies for a living, you know, it was on. Uh, a few things inspired me to make uh, Dear White People. I think it really began uh, through my college experience. You know, I was one of very, very, very few black people at my college. And uh, not only that, but a lot of the kids I encountered just, they had never really encountered black people before. And they had really, they were unfamiliar with cultures different than theirs. And so, you know, I very much felt like I was kind of on an island in this school and I just, started kind of, you know, taking notes and writing down stories and anecdotes and these characters just started to kind of form in my head and uh, very slice of life. I thought there was some really funny stuff in it, but it just wasn't a great script. I wasn't a good enough writer to write that then. But I kept working on it and, you know, over a period of about seven years, basically got it to where it is now, uh, Dear White People, uh, which is definitely more of a, um, you know, a satire, it's more social commentary, it's more about the bigger uh, experience of being a minority in America. Uh, for the film, I was definitely inspired by a few different things, you know, Do the Right Thing, School Days, I, I often cite as big influences, but even movies like Love Jones, um, you know, uh, Ease by You even, even though that's like not even the same genre as my movie, just movies for uh, black people, for adults, uh, that had something to say, that had a unique perspective, you know, I feel like there's not as much of those anymore and I wanted to, I wanted to try and, and be a part of bringing that back as like a, a thing, you know, like the black art house has really kind of uh, gotten a lot smaller uh, and the black, you know, the market for, for black adults has gotten a lot sm smaller. So, you know, if my film can in any way <laughs> bring some of that back, that'd be awesome. Sam White, whose show uh, in the movie Dear White People gives the, the movie its name, you know, not all the characters agree with her and not all the characters agree with what she has to say. And that's what I want, you know, I feel like if you're gonna make a movie about race or race identity, it has to be a conversation. It can't just be like, you know, this is my, I, I can't be preaching to an audience, you know, and telling them what to think about it because it's, it's not a simple issue at all.